Burkholderia Sapatia Complex, Wikipedia Article Audio CCUG 12691 and 13226, CFBP 2227, CIP 80.24, DSM 7288, Hambi 1976, ICMP 5796, JCM 5964, LMG 1222, NBRC 14074, NCCB 76047, NCPPB 2993, NCTC 10743, NRRLB 14810. Burkholderia Sapatia Complex, or simply Burkholderia Sapatia, is a group of catalase producing, lactose non fermenting, gram negative bacteria composed of at least 20 different species including B. sapatia, B. multivorans, B. cenocepatia, B. vietnamensis, B. stabilis, B. ambifaria, B. dolisa, B. anthena, B. pyrocinia and B. eubinensis. B. sapatia is an opportunistic human pathogen that most often causes pneumonia in immunocompromised individuals with underlying lung disease. Patients with sickle cell hemoglobinopathies are also at risk. The species also attacks young onion and tobacco plants, as well as displaying a remarkable ability to digest oil. Pathogenesis Diagnosis BCC organisms are typically found in water and soil and can survive for prolonged periods in moist environments. They show a relatively poor virulence. Virulence factors include adherence to plastic surfaces and production of several enzymes such as elastase and gelatinase. Also relevant might be the ability to survive attacks from neutrophils. Person-to-person -person spread has been documented. As a result, many hospitals, clinics, and camps have enacted strict isolation precautions for those infected with BCC. Infected individuals are often treated in a separate area from uninfected patients to limit spread, since BCC infection can lead to a rapid decline in lung function and result in death. Diagnosis of BCC involves culturing the bacteria from clinical specimens such as sputum or blood. BCC organisms are naturally resistant to many common antibiotics, including aminoglycosides and polymyxin B and this fact is exploited in the identification of the organism. The organism is usually cultured in Burkholderia sapatia agar which contains crystal violet and bile salts to inhibit the growth of gram-positive cocci and ticarcillin and polymyxin B to inhibit the growth of other gram-negative bacilli. It also contains phenol red pH indicator which turns pink when it reacts with alkaline byproducts generated by the bacteria when it grows. Alternatively, Oxidation fermentation polymix and bacitracin lactose agar can be used. Off blow contains polymyxin and bacitracin. It also contains lactose, and organisms such as BCC that do not ferment lactose turn the pH indicator yellow, which helps to distinguish it from other organisms that may grow on off blow agar such as Candida species, Pseudomonas fluorescens, and Stenotrophmonas species. Treatment typically includes multiple antibiotics and may include ceftazidime, doxycycline, piperacillin, meropenem, chloramphenicol, and trimethoprim slash sulfamethoxazole. Although CO trimoxazole has been generally considered the drug of choice for B. sapatia infections, ceftazidime, doxycycline, piperacillin, and meropenem are considered to be viable alternative options in cases where CO trimoxazole cannot be administered because of hypersensitivity reactions, intolerance, or resistance. In April 2007, 
researchers from the University of Western Ontario School of Medicine, working with a group from Edinburgh, announced that they had discovered a potential method to kill the organism, involving disruption in the biosynthesis of an essential cell membrane sugar. Treatment Also tobramycin nebulizer is used in UK. It works locally sparing systemic side effects plus being sensitive. B. Cepatia was discovered by Walter Burkholder in 1949 as the cause of onion skin rot, and first described as a human pathogen in the 1950s. It was first isolated in patients with cystic fibrosis in 1977 when it was known as Pseudomonas cepatia. In the 1980s, Outbreaks of B. cepatia in individuals with CF were associated with a 35% death rate. B. cepatia has a large genome, containing twice the amount of genetic material as E. coli. History